So <laughs> tell me about these hidden senses. Yeah. So like you kind of touched on, we do have the five that everyone talks about that you do in your little, you know, sensory unit in third grade science, um, which is sight, sound, um, smell, taste, and touch. But we have three extra ones that we call the hidden senses in occupational therapy. And those are called proprioception, vestibular, and interoception. So those are the like medical terminology. I'll break it down a little bit more for um, those of us who don't have all that background. Um, so proprioception is a fancy way of saying body awareness. We have uh, receptors in e every joint in our body from like the tips of your fingers all the way up to bigger joints like hips and knees um, that send signals to your brain that let you know mostly that your body is on the ground because we're humans and we like we live on earth and we like gravity. Um, <laughs> and so uh, that is something that our brain looks for that feedback from. And then vestibular is actually controlled in the inner ear. Um, we have crystals that float on top of our inner ear fluid um, that tell our brain what direction our body is moving in, be that forward, backwards, or rotational. Um, and then interoception is a big umbrella term for senses that honestly are still being researched, um, but it's everything internally. So be that chemical receptors, um, stretch receptors, organ systems, it's how our the inside of our body is telling our brain what's going on. So this is things like hunger, thirst, heart rate, um, body temperature, pain, nausea, um, and all of those things that can get all misconstrued for both adults and especially kiddos.